the next crew heads to the space station, navigating the lunar landscape, and a view to look forward to. A few of the stories to tell you about this week at NASA. A SpaceX Dragon spacecraft launched to the International Space Station March 2nd on our SpaceX Crew-6 mission. The crew, including NASA astronauts Stephen Bowen and Woody Hoberg, will conduct research and technology demonstrations on the space station to benefit life on Earth and future Artemis human exploration missions to the Moon and eventually to Mars. In 2024, a Firefly Aerospace Lunar Lander will deliver a payload to the Moon called the Lunar GNSS Receiver Experiment. The payload is expected to receive signals from two satellite constellations orbiting Earth and obtain the first ever global navigation satellite systems fix on the lunar surface. This technology could help provide precise navigation for future exploration missions on the Moon. A new simulation shows how our Nancy Grace Roman Space Telescope's wide field of view will help unveil the universe. The simulation compares several regions of the image, depicting the Hubble Space Telescope's field of view, with the full zoomed-out image, which represents how much more Roman is capable of surveying. The Roman Space Telescope is targeted for launch by May 2027. The NASA Aeronautics Dream With Us Design Challenge is an opportunity for middle and high school students to share their visions for the future of aviation. Student teams are being asked to develop and present plans for a more sustainable commercial aircraft. The deadline for submissions is May 15th. For more details, visit go.nasa.gov slash aero dash dream. That's what's up this week at NASA. For more on these and other stories, follow us on the web at nasa.gov slash twan.